it takes a lot for me to really not like a Tom and Jerry cartoon, but this is exactly what we get with Down and Outing. This is a 1961 Gene Deitch cartoon and um, with a story by Lars Bourne. And honestly, the animation style is inconsistent and at times pretty terrible. There were some times that I quite liked the animation style. Um, without spoiling anything, it's the bit where Tom's flying through the air and he gets closer to the ground and the shadow underneath his butt obviously gets closer and closer to him. And I thought that that was effective and that was very well done. But the narrative is not that interesting. The setting, yeah, I didn't think it worked very well, but they certainly, Tom and Jerry certainly utilised the equipment and the props that were around them, which I'll talk about in a moment. But ultimately, I thought it was sloppy, very sloppy. So the Tom is, well, Tom's owner is going on a fishing trip, and I will be honest, the design of the human is appalling. I feel like at this point, animation was changing from being soft and delicate to having a lot of, a lot of sharp edges and bold, blocky colours, and it just, I, I get the experimental style of it, um, and they really kind of perfected that style in the late eighties and early nineties, in my opinion. By they, I mean pretty much every studio who was doing this, but at the time. It was rough around the edges and it's really unpleasant to look at. But not everything is kind of bold and blocky and jagged. A lot of the things, uh, a lot of, you know, facial expressions, particularly with Tom um, and, and certain objects that they interact with, are not in that kind of jagged, blocky style. I don't know if anybody knows the technical term for that. Please feel free to let me know. I'm not an animator. I cannot draw to save my life. But some of them are a little bit softer and a little bit easier on the eye and because it's combining the two it's like they're trying to be classic tom and jerry with a modern twist and it just doesn't work it really doesn't work um so tom goes off in the back of this car uh to go on this fishing trip and jerry manages to sneak a ride as well and most of the action takes place in the back of this car and as i said the setting's not the most exciting but to its credit, they do manage to use quite a lot of props. There are a lot of different things they interact with. Um, Tom makes some yelping noises that I think worked very well. But ultimately, it was just a mess. The style of animation is really garish. It's really horrible. The attention to detail is appalling. Um, for example, Hanna-Barbera have really great detailing in their cartoons. And then Chuck Jones, some of Chuck Jones's, there is a little bit more detail and the facial expressions are a little bit more prominent. And then it's like we've taken five steps backwards with this and there's just a lack of care and a lack of attention to detail. And it feels really fuzzy when it's, when it's not jagged and sharp, it feels fuzzy and like I'm squinting to try and get some clarity. And it just feels like a mess. So the narrative isn't great. It's not terrible. But when you couple that with the really abysmal animation, it's just, it's uncomfortable. It really is uncomfortable. 